Hello everyone, Cyric here. Been a while since my last stream, but this is Cathedral. It's a game that looked really cool. It reviewed well. I'm excited to try it. I know nothing about it other than the trailer, and that has positive reviews on Steam. It looks super cool. I know that's, um, kind of like Shovel Knight as a Metroidvania, sort of. Doesn't look like it's one-to-one -one with Shovel Knight, but has a lot of pogo sticking. So, you know, definitely inspired to some degree. Anyway, gonna just kind of dive right into it. And right now I'm playing this with a controller. That might change since I've been having some issues with my controller, so I might need to swap to the keyboard, but we'll see. Okay. Well, let's just get our name going. I did it. I won the game. I like this little pan that does. I assume that there'll be a different knight on each of those based on what your knight currently looks like on progress. Let's see... I want to see the run animation again on this knight. Yeah, the run animation, something about it reminds me a bit of um, Wizards and Warriors a bit. I could be wrong on that. So, we got a down stab. Got a slash, so that's different from Shovel Knight. Um, doesn't look like there's any sort of up attack. No double jump or anything. We got a dash. Fun? No. There, there is dash, but I don't have it yet, I guess. I don't have block either. So I can jump and I can slash. Okay. Controls are confirmed now. Man, we're just getting right into it. <laughs> I was expecting some sort of cutscene or something, but no, that was just a save point, and we're going. Um, I don't know if this game has any sort of plot. Okay, we apparently have no idea where we are. That is the plot. We are in some weird cathedral filled with monsters. Find the way out. I don't know if there's fake walls, so I'm just going to be slashing at every wall I see that looks like it could be fake. Game controls well. So yeah, very smooth controls, can't really say anything more than that, just feels really nice to play so far. I'm going to guess these spikes are not instant kill, but you know, let's avoid them. Got some boxes. Or boxes. I don't know how important money is in this game. No, I want that. Also, I noticed that, like, I'm only getting about 1 or 10 or so for most of this money, but I started at... I'm over 900 already, so I guess that they give you some sort of starting significant amount. Oh, bats take more than one hit. <laughs> I was not expecting that. I'm not going to bother with every box. Oh! I may have screwed up by destroying that box. Maybe not. I might not actually be able to make it all the way up here. Unless I'm missing something on how these fans work. Like, they're not really... fans in the sense of, um... like, putting me up all that high. They just kind of give my chump a slight boost. I was planning on maybe using the one box to stand on, but I don't think that I could get... Oh, was I about to actually make it onto that platform and I just hopped down? One last try. No. I'm gonna go in a different direction. They'll probably turn out that I was just missing something incredibly obvious. I guess I could've pogoed off the bat, maybe. Well, let's see what the other directions have first, anyway. Okay. Can I do anything with this? 
Can I pick you up? Ah. Okay. That looks... Is this thing gonna shoot at me? No, it's just a gate. A plus down plus X. Oh, okay. Pogo attack. Nah, this isn't really Ghouls and Ghosts. This is Shovel Knight more. The jumping is definitely not Ghouls and Ghosts. I can move backwards. B U. Grapple point. A down plus... Oh, okay. Pogo point, rather. Uh, before I go that way, let's go through this door. Let's see, does that... Okay, that's the map. I need to sometimes remember that there's no upward slash. Since you can slash in every other direction, it makes me just automatically want to slash up. Oh, you look nasty. Okay. I'm not sure if there's fake walls or not. Like, so far I haven't seen one, but looks like there probably will be. This seems like the type of game that would have them. I have no idea where all of this is leading. Okay, that's a checkpoint. So, the downward path led to around here. So that just leads back to the initial um, checkpoint statue. Oh, these jump. Let's get this chest. Not chasing that coin. Oh, the slimes are sleeping. That's cute. And also very helpful because it means I can sneak up on them. Hello, not Castlevania skeleton. For you. Well, that's very simple. Oh, these slimes are gonna be a pain on the way up. Maybe not. This one is. Nope, never mind. I should honestly probably get to that checkpoint. My health has seen better days. I have one potion, and I think that's pressing the stick to, um, consume it. Do I need to do anything to the checkpoint, or is it just here? Yeah, I kind of assumed the checkpoint would heal me. I don't know if this potion is, um, something that refreshes, or if it's a one and done. Did the checkpoint say win under it? I don't think it did. I think it just had, um... Bowie, like, runes. I can look and see if it's actual legible text soon. This looks so much like a fake wall. <laughs> the next time I look at a checkpoint, I'll pay attention. Oh, can I make the slime respawn? Spawn? No, I need to leave the room, I guess. That or the respawn radius is far. Okay. Let's get that chest. I don't think the green slimes react. None? There we go. And back to full health. That's good. Gonna open this. I'll take it. This is probably the gate. Yeah, it is. And probably. Oh, I was going to assume a boss, but is this double jump or. Nope, it's a map. I don't know if this game has double jump. I know this game does have a lot of cool things from the trailer, 
I don't remember if double jump is one of them. Lock the map in the current region. Check the map often to find secrets. Okay. Wait a bit. We do have the mini map as well, which is nice. Hi, Toast. Oh, I can't go in here. Is this a shop? No, it's just another area. Could be an area that leads to a shop. Like, I assume I'm going to have a use for all this money at some point. We got Pogo. So far, the Pogo has admittedly been less essential than I thought it would be. So, not quite as much Shovel Knight. But that's fine. Bats with an oddly large map health. I can't believe I didn't kill that. At least they don't really have much in the way of invincibility. Okay. Where am I? Pressing that button to open the map, and that's not the map button. I'm just in some area behind this door still, I guess. Or, no, that's the door I went to. I've gone quite far. Oh, checkpoint room, I think. Is. Okay. Oh, okay. There are secret. There are fake walls. Good to know. Yeah, I guess that does say win on the bottom of the statue. Looks like it does anyway. Can't get to that. Can't pogo off of those. I'm not even sure if I'm going the right direction at this point. And I guess it's not necessarily a wrong direction. But some directions are definitely better than others, usually. Nope, 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 that... That was a problem. <laughs> then just... do that. And get rid of you. Probably not worth it. Okay, I can make it back. That... Uh, Okay, so it looks like that skeleton kind of tosses uh, far, medium, short, medium, far is his throwing pattern, I think. One second, I need to adjust my headphones. There we go. Should still be fine. Um, the impossibly dark Metroid horror Metroidvania you were thinking of is Marrow. Um... And you know, I'm oddly fond of Marrow, but yeah, it's pretty easy to be a to be a better game than Marrow. Like, I do like it, but that game has some serious. Oh, well, okay. Uh, that game has some serious issues. Oh man, I'm all the way back here. This game has some rather mean checkpointing, it seems. How close was I to, like... I guess that's not actually that mean, it's one. I spent a lot of time killing these statues when I can honestly just... I can honestly just lose all my progress because I'm bad at jumping. Why do I keep jumping up here when I know there's fireballs coming? I don't understand it. Yeah, it's one room. <laughs> um, you know, I, I love Marrow, but it has issues. I 
have a hard time recommending that game unless people know what they're getting into. This seems very solid. Oh! No, no, go back, go back. <laughs> There's a skull on the minimap, which probably means I can reclaim my lost money if I go there, right? And now that I know that spikes for instant kill, I need to be a bit more careful about that. Or... Okay, I guess it doesn't mean that? Maybe it just means that that's where I died to let me know, oh hey, something killed you here. Bit strange, but okay. I feel like I probably shouldn't be in the entirely new region yet, when I didn't find anything in the previous one. Unless the um, cathedral is more like the hub, and then these are kind of the side levels. Completely different tone, at any rate. This is, has like an almost Kirby vibe to it. This is suspicious. Never mind. So, since I think all rooms are shown on the map, maybe I should just not worry too much until I get a proper map. Because there's presumably a map for this region somewhere. Ah, uh, you're gonna be a problem. Okay, that was a bit scary. What? Did it just take off all of my health in one hit? I think I might want to try a different area. <laughs> I think I was at full health. Giant door that I never went in. What's in the giant door? At least you don't really get penalized that much for, um... Okay, I can't do anything here yet. You don't really get penalized that much for dying. Like, I lost a tiny bit of money. And... The checkpoints seem kind of spread out. Because, like, if you look, the previous checkpoint was all the way over here. But... Eh? I don't know. Seems fine, for the most part. Like, I'm not losing items I got, or really much of anything. Or, like, shortcuts I've made, I'm literally just losing money on death, as far as I can tell, at least. So, I suspect I'm gonna be dying a lot. Okay, there... You know, I just said that this game has somewhat, um, less than generous checkpointing, it just got very generous with the checkpointing, so wherever. Is that mimic up there? Is that what this is? Oh. Okay, so spikes don't instant kill me. What's going on with that chest up there? I kind of saw it doing something, rather. Was someone looting it? Was there, like, a character looting it in the background? Okay. Made it here, at any rate. Okay, so what's going on with this chest? Because I assume that something's gonna happen with it. No, 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 no. I need health. Okay. This one I can reach. And all of this is fake. Is this going to take me to a fire area of some sort, maybe? Nope, more cathedral. Oh, this thing's adorable. It's probably going to kill me. Looks like it's not an enemy and or at least not an enemy yet, is probably a um, cutscene character of some sort. Oh, you think that was the thing that was looting the chest? Okay. I got my shield! Hooray! I knew there was a block button, so... I wasn't sure when I was gonna get the shield. Apparently the answer was right now. Uh... So these skulls are basically Medusa heads. I keep trying to pogo open the chest, and it never works. <laughs> that was... oddly generous checkpointing. Food. A 
feel like I could have made it there fast enough. Oh, wait. I totally can. I can just hit the one down here. Not sure if I can free fall. Yeah, I probably could have free falled all the way to the right. Oh, never mind. These are not connected. I thought they were. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> money, suspicious money. Weird arrow symbol that I don't recognize. Okay. Map say what the arrow symbol means. Ammo recharger. Okay. Oh, I can toggle my mini map. These are going to fall on me. Or it's a boss, or. Okay, it's this. Um, I go for money. I go for money. Probably mistake. Never mind. Seems to have worked out. This game has gotten really weirdly generous with the checkpointing. Literally, the moment I said it was being a bit less than generous. Is it okay? This is just a health recharger. That means boss. Where are we fighting? Ball the first porn or Bram? Not sure if that's an H or an M. It's probably Bram for like Bram Stoker. Oh yeah, it's definitely an M considering the way the V looks. Oh. That did not work out. I'm doing a really bad job at actually killing this thing. Oh! Never mind, I won. Art, give me. Well, that's nice. Much more Castlevania than I was expecting from this game. Yeah, it's wisely. Okay. Okay. That is the arrow button. I got a new quest. Where's my new quest? Where'd my quests go? Find someone who knows more about it. Okay. Oh, now that I just lost half my health to random enemies. The important thing is that these can go through walls. I assume they also have a chance of dropping arrows, since I'm currently out of arrows. And it did say use your arrows wisely. I might be in the. Oh, wait! Okay, I got arrows. Didn't even notice myself getting them. There they are. I can do this without consuming them. Oh, hello. Ah, these things are mean. I'm gonna turn the menu map off for a bit. Okay. Well, see, this game kind of really does throw you right into it. 
Like, I wouldn't say this is overly demanding or anything, but it got harder faster than I was expecting. Okay, I will refill after I kill you. Okay, five is my cap for now. I should not have chance that. <laughs> but yeah, kind of just the constant pace that things happen at in this game is pretty satisfying so far. I feel like I'm always moving, there's really very little downtime. Okay... Can I make it here? Yes. Can you map come back for a second? What's... What's the exclamation point mean? It's not on the legend. Maybe that means something really important. <laughs> Did I miss some sort of secret, maybe? Probably. So, I think all I can- oh, yeah, I totally did. Oh no, I used my potion on accident. There's this room that I didn't access before. I don't remember why. Oh, because this was the crusher room. Can I access it now? I guess I always could have. Oh, hello. Might end up needing to do a bit of backtracking, but you know what? It's worth it. Oh, this room kind of changed. Okay, there must be a different one that affects that one remaining tile, right? There. Did that toggle off? No? Oh. <laughs> okay, game. Sure. I'll take it. Yeah, this is like partial old school Castlevania and partial new school Castlevania is a good way of describing it. Like, parts of it definitely feel like newer Castlevanias, and parts of it definitely feel a lot like older Castlevanias. I guess it's a bit, um, Order of Ecclesia in that regard. And nowhere near as much Shovel Knight as I was expecting. Like, we have this downward pogo thing, but it's kind of just one more ability at our disposal. It doesn't seem like the highlight by any means. Like, it's nice. I'm making use of it. But it's not quite as essential as I was expecting. Let's see. I guess maybe I'll go to that. I oh, there's the. Oh! I can get those now. Also, man, that's just freaking a, um. That's a missile container from Metroid. Straight up. Arrows are missiles, everyone. This game seems to wear its um, influences on its sleeve, which is entirely okay. Like, it's taking a lot of influence from things for sure, but it's also still doing its own thing. Like, it doesn't... Like, I'm making all these comparisons to, like, Shovel Knight or Castlevania or Metroid, and, like, yeah, they're all in here, but, like, it's not really any one of those. It's very much its own thing. And... Back we go. I think I got everything here. This is room. Not sure how that room connects, really. It's below me. What? 
It connects to... Oh. Okay. I need to go through the door first. And then it's... Oh, I see it! That was clever. Hello? Anything else here other than money, or just a fun little money room? There is something else! More money! <laughs> I don't trust you. Okay. I don't know if this game has mimics, so I'm going to just do the safe thing and assume every chest is going to kill me. Oh. I'm not sure what was there, but it was worth a lot of money. Yeah, this is, um, for those that missed it, this is Cathedral. It's, I think it's normally $15 and currently discounted down to 10 I could be mistaken on that. So far, it seems really good. <laughs> the map is good. Um, like, I did have to find the map for it to reveal all of this stuff. This is a bit odd. I, there's, like, actual bricks up here. I don't know if I should make more of that or not. These things start spawning ever since I got this new weapon. I guess that they're just going to be here now, because they weren't before. Oh, didn't even notice that this was a kind of one-way path until I got the weapon. Huh. Yeah, um, this seems totally worth the 10 bucks. Probably also worth the 15 if you don't get it on sale, to be honest. I still early impressions. That could change, but so far, yeah. I'm liking it a whole lot. It seems really fun. Go away. Go away. Uh, oh, there's like a tiny room. Okay, it's not quite a tiny room. Oh, I can do this now. I don't... Oh, I know how to get up there. This is where the Shovel Knight part comes in. Here. Ooh. Let's get the chests first. Okay. Up. And there we go. And these are going to be exactly like missiles, I guess, in that they start out really limited and by the end of the game I'm just going to have like 150 of the things or something crazy like that and no clue how to possibly spend them all. Oh, go away homing skull. No. These are going to kill me. <laughs> Well, it went away. I don't know if it's going to come back. I guess not. There we go. Mm, I guess I'll toggle that again, just in case. So, I guess important thing to note, um, based on that one treasure room, the map does show me where rooms connect, but it won't reveal, like, tiny fake platforms or anything. Or, like, rooms that are fake walls within the same, like, square. All I can see is, like, the connections between individual squares. I can see my rough location within the room itself, though. So, like, you know, if it looked... Like, if this was all ceiling, I saw that there was a huge giant rectangle above me, even though it's all one thing. It's like, okay, there's a way to access that somewhere. Oh, wow. He's dying one hit, huh? Probably shouldn't have used anywhere near that many arrows. Oh, well. Okay. Seems like this is going to be a central checkpoint area for a while. Uh, which way to go? 
What's all this? Armor augmentation. That's gonna be a thing, I guess. I have no idea how big this game is at all, by the way. Like, I was assuming it was going to be like kind of a smaller thing, but looking at all this, it might be honestly a pretty long game. This doesn't want to toggle off. I wonder if it has something to do with this shiny one up here. I can't seem to reach that. Looks like I'll be getting... What will I be getting? I wonder if it's like a guided missile thing or if it's something that runs along walls. I'm getting some way of pushing these things at some point. Yeah, the Red Skulls don't really home, they just go in straight lines, which... You know, still a problem. <laughs> that initial home is going to be hard to deal with. Are you a boss room? Maybe? Uh, no, but you are doing something. Oh, hey, it's Lil Mage Friend. Are you the final boss? Or are you the mascot character? Huh. I guess you're the mascot character. Oh, this thing was in the trailer. Was not expecting it to be anywhere near this early. Okay. Go away, eyeball. Ow. Okay, that's another eyeball gone. Oh, cool, loot. I'm liking this boss theme it has going on. I am acutely aware that these four eyeballs do not make up its entire health bar. Okay, the big one is currently immune to damage. I'm assuming that'll change right now. It's a bit dangerous, but it should be okay. If it swerves, I can get to the right side pretty easily. Oh, that was crazy, honestly. I feel like the first boss was harder. I got the Welcome to the Cathedral achievement, by the way. Oh. Uh. I guess there was nothing else to explore in that room. Maybe. Officially mascot character. We don't know. So I'm guessing this is maybe a different one of these soul things compared to the um, previous one, because the other one wasn't um, trapped or anything. Okay, we've seen all it has to offer. Definitely not trapped. This is a good idea, I'm sure. You think it might be the same one that just somehow got itself trapped over there? Possibly. Ooh, thanks. 